Yo, 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 yo. It's Terrell, Hall of Fame, D Line, TBKC, and all that other good shit. This is Bully Rants, and uh, it will be posted on Facebook also. But check this out, man. Look, I don't care what none of y'all got to say. That's just, <laughs> yeah, I'm back on this shit, and I'm going to talk my shit, and we're going to do it like that. But let me tell you this, like, man, yeah, uh, some things have been posted, but it's going to be more to be posted. Ain't nobody going to stop on none of this shit, man. Dog abuse is dog abuse. I don't care which way you try to cut it, man. And this community is like, for real, for real, everybody showing their true colors in this community. And all, like, all shit is like sort of thrown out the window where it's, it's amazing to me to see, you know what I mean? Um, you know, a bunch of grown men, yeah, and I know it's a glare, but the light is right there. But uh, a bunch of grown men attack, you know, I ain't gonna call it, you know what I mean? Just, just a mature lady. You know what I mean? She's not no little kid or nothing like that. This lady, you know, it got her own thing going on. She's trying to do the right thing. And y'all basically want to change the conversation and this whole Bashar talk to her. You know what I mean? When really he's the conversation. Because no matter what, if you didn't, you know what I mean? If you didn't agree with the fact that uh, I'm going to... I'm when y'all see my expose, you know what I mean? When I when I really go into this thing on a longer video, y'all understand. But, you know, y'all trying to divert by saying, well, why didn't you, you know, uh, tell this? Why didn't you do this? Why didn't you do that? Y'all don't know what was done. This information was put out there, you know what I mean? Really for the public's general purpose to show the way that these dogs was living and some of the things that have been going on, you know, from, uh, uh, from top to bottom. So... You know, when you when you talk about, you know, bribing judges and, uh, you know, steroid use and you start talking about, you know, what I'm saying these horrible conditions, blood, urine, feces everywhere. This shit is like terrible. And yes, I will be posting some of this information up. I don't I don't know how to post pictures on YouTube. I'm going to have a boy do it for me. But uh, real talk, man, it's disgusting. And what people want to do is keep on ch changing the narrative. The narrative can't be changed, you know what I mean? You can't go into no courtroom and say, well, Billy down the street was selling dope and it didn't, no, no, no. We talk here to talk about you. And the saddest point about this is, is in the actual dog community, we have people who are willing to defend these disgusting, disgusting, disgusting ass conditions that these dogs was living in. It, it's amazing to me. You know, um, I've been around this game for a long, long time, man. And uh, like I say, the American bully community never ceased to amaze me, you know. The American bully community is one of uh, very, very, very weak standards, you know. Uh, we feel like we can change everything. We can tell whatever lies. And if it's popular, we can go uh, go along with it. The truth of the matter is, is that uh, what we've seen is just deplorable. And uh, there's going to be a big question, you know. Radio show, you know, whatever we're going to do with this not just this topic, but this, this situation in our community is, you know, why are the registries not doing anything about it? You know, I have a, a proactive plan that I plan on putting in place very, very soon, you know, as I work out the kinks on my situation. But, uh, you know, I, I, I just don't understand how, you know, uh, people can be promoted that are doing these type of things. I don't give a fuck who you get. I don't care if you get, you know, Barack Obama to come and say, oh, yeah, he's a good person and this, that, and the other. It can't nobody tell me anything about what I've seen. You know what I mean? In 20 years of dogs, I've never had my dogs piled up in shit like that. I've never had, you know, all of these incidences and excuses about why this wasn't done, why that wasn't done. You know what I mean? I've had dogs long enough to know that even if you have a dog in bad conditions for a couple of days, they're not going to have that kind of sores and that kind of mange. And the stuff is mad at I Yes, we all have puppies. I keep my puppies on shavings. And I know that it doesn't take one or two days for the shavings to get mad at like that. Literally, that shit is weak you know, a week of not, uh, of not changing that shit for it to be mad at like that. That was just utterly disgusting, but we continue to see this and we, you know, and what people don't even understand the sick, how sick that can be is I've seen it happen before. You know what I mean? I've seen that happen before. I've actually went and taken the dog back because the dog was in similar conditions to that. And even on those shavings, they had this dog that I had sold in a cage, in the shavings, just like that, matted down, man. 
And as I got, you know, I took the whole fucking thing, threw it on the back of the truck, took the dog, you know what I mean, just to get the hell out of there so I didn't catch a case. When I got home and I started trying to pick these shavings up, bro, it was maggots and shit all up under this stuff. The stuff was actually radiating heat because, you know what I mean, the urine and that ammonia shit, it, it, it was really hot coming up out of there. You know, I'm looking at this shit and I'm like, is that steam coming up off of there? This is the same conditions that this man had these dogs in. And yes, I'm talking about Bashar and Muscle Tone Bullies. You know, our community, and I'm not going to let it go, you know, I know that it's been a bully routine that they've, they've scared a lot of people from opening their mouths and different shit like that. You know, that shit don't work on me, dog. I'm going to tell y'all that. The whole community needs to keep on knowing about this. It's going to be more pictures. It's going to be more text messaging and different things that shows, you know, exactly what this dude was about. All the lies, you know, all the changing of dates, you know, the falsifying of, um, uh, of, uh, health certificates and all kind of things that this is what you know this is what the community is pushing this is what one of the largest registries is backing you know it is it, it nobody in this community is going to shame any of us who's serious about this shit into not speaking on it because the funniest thing about it is is this is our community and to have this type of person on banners and people treating him like he's some kind of great dog person and he's the king of American bullies and all this dumb shit and he can't even keep his dogs clean he can't not, he can't he can't even take a uh, good DNA test without all the lies and the bullshit behind him and yes we, it's a lot of information that is undisputable how he lied on DNA tests to you know puppies uh having puppies and different shit like that man it, it's a disgrace everything that's in the bio, everything that's in the code of conduct whether it's the abkc or the tbkc or the brc or whatever this guy has broken basically every code of conduct that that's allowed but because he can sell a dog for a certain price or he knows a couple celebrities we're gonna push this shit it's you know it's gotten to the point where it's over with you know i don't give a fuck who gets mad or whatever don't be mad at the messenger you know what i mean start talking about what's really going on you know and uh, we'll have a lot of videos educational wise, but I'm just making this video to tell y'all, man, if y'all got something to say about this shit, man, say, say y'all peace, man. Do not let these cats scare y'all out of, oh, they, they on my neck. Fuck them. You know what I mean? They ain't gonna do shit. You know what I mean? It, if they was real about what they was talking about, they would be on his neck. You know, it's just the truth, man. We got to keep on pushing and stand up for our community, man. It ain't nothing about hate. It ain't nothing about jealousy. It's about standing up for the breed and doing the right thing by the breed, man. <sighs> Maybe tomorrow we'll get the real video up. I have some, you know, videos that are definitely not on this trashy topic. But like I told y'all, man, uh, it's probably the worst situation I've ever seen in the American bully community. You know, and, and it's, it's a long, long history with, uh, you know, muscle tone and it needs to be exposed. I'll let y'all later. Peace.